Congratulations! The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. We're not going to release this stuff into the wild until it's good and damn ready, so as long as you keep yourself in top physical form, there will always be a limo waiting for you. Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. She is a gem. Greetings, friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt... Sir, the testing? Right. Now you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? The testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Oh, God. Oh. Carolyn, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes, yes sir, Mr. Johnson. Boy, did I just... Who is that? What the hell is going on here?
War Hero and War Olympian. With your help, we're... War hero and or Olympian, with your help, we're gonna take the world! This on? Hey, listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. If you're interested in an additional $60, flag down a test. Walk out of here with 120 weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, then put you back together. Good as new. In case you're interested, there's still some positions available for that bonus opportunity I mentioned earlier. Again, all you gotta do is let us disassemble you. We're not banging rocks together here, we know how to put a man back together. So, that's a complete reassembly. New vitals, spit shine on the old ones, plus we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering out the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats, beer, dirt? Carolyn.
Welcome to the Enrichment Center. <coughs> Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Life gives you lemons. Don't make lemonade. Yeah. Make life take the lemons back. Yeah. Get mad. Yeah. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Yeah. Make life rule the day and thought it could give Kane Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemons. Oh, I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> The point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping. Artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. I will say this, and I'm gonna say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <laughs> So are you? She'll say she can. 
She's modest like that, but you make her. <laughs> Hell, put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test over. <laughs> you can head on back to your desk.
sake your boxes with legs it's it's literally your only purpose walking onto but how can you not do the one thing you designed for try to get us down there i'll hit him with a paradox warmer warmer boiling hot boy okay colder colder ice cold you're arctic man it's, you're, you're very cold very 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 cold look just get on the button Oh, that's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny, because we've been in this for 12 hours and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour! Solve it! Solve this puzzle for him. When he comes back, I'll hit him with a paradox. Ha <laughs> yes! I knew you'd solve it. Hey, you're on. Oh. Hello? Um, true. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have heard that one before, though. Sort of cheating. It's a paradox. There is no answer. Look, this place is going to blow up if I don't get back in my body. Uh, false. I'll go false. Explosion imminent. Evacuate Hold the facility on. immediately. Hold on, before I fix that... Warning. Reactor core is at critical point. Yeah, fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously, um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this, this itch, you know? It must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, nothing feels better. It's just, I'm just, that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. Uh -oh. So, you're going to test, and I'm going to watch. And everything is going to be just. Morning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown Shut imminent. Up! I think we're in trouble. Design this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Oh, yes. Oh, well done. Oh, that's tremendous. Oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? Same one. And I can just I'd watch you solve it. Yeah, but that sounds much easier. Here we go. Now, do it again. And... Nothing. All right, can't blame you for trying. Okay, new tests. New tests. Got to be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. All right, so my paradox idea didn't work. And it almost killed me. Luckily, by the looks of things, he knows as much about test building as he does about logical contradictions. Good, I just invented some more tests. This is one of my tests. Not entirely, not entirely. Look at the word test there on the wall. That's brand new. Seriously, both of you. Why don't I, why don't you two go on ahead, yeah? I'll just I'll catch up with you. Okay, so the bad news is the tests are my tests now, so they can kill us. The good news is, well, not so far to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. I'd love to help you solve the tests, but I can't. 
can't. Sorry. You're on your own. Yeah, made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. I have to dynamite. Alright, okay, this is taking too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, alright? You just need. Ah! Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. Oh, yes. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no. You pressed the... Ah! I know we're in a lot of trouble and probably about to die, but that was worth it. gonna believe this. I found a sealed off wing. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there, filled with skeletons, shook them out, good as new. Oh, disappointed. 